What's good folks, Rudd's here. Today's soap review will feature Euphros, Dama de Noche. Uh, Euphros is a Span Spanish, yeah, Spanish artisan uh, based out of Barcelona, Spain. Um, they don't have a storefront. They've been widely popular in the uh, hobbyist wet shaving community only via word of mouth and uh, email transactions. So they're probably not the most popular. You may or may not have heard of them, but they do uh, have quite the following. Uh, for those of us that have been around quite a long time, you've seen them pop up here and there. Um, they're made by a gentleman named Manuel Garcia, who also goes by the name Habon Man um, in several forums. So you may have seen that soap reference as well. Um, happy to report that actually as a U.S. customer, you can now purchase this through westcoastshaving.com. All right, so Dama de Noche is night jasmine, or means night jasmine, I should say. And uh, this is a single note accord of jasmine. So jasmine, as many of you know, is a white floral. Um, one of the more manly florals in my estimation, at least to my taste. Um, but this is... This is one of those uh, white floral scents uh, with not much else going on. Saying that though, I will tell you that the uh, scent of jasmine is complex on its own. It opens floral and bright um, before a bit of a smoothness and earthiness towards the back from the uh, the plant itself, I would I would assume. Scent strength on this is mid-strong, both off of the container and once you've uh, lathered and shaved with it. And uh, similarly scented soaps available in the wet shaving space are Barristan Man Symphonia, as well as the Dapper Dragon Jasmine and Vanilla. All right, so this is the uh, Euphros Premium Tallow Base. Uh, they also offer their formula in vegan. Um, but I was fortunate enough to be pipped a uh, Premium Tallow to try. The soap is medium firm, maybe closer to firm. Loads very easily into your brush of choice, whether it's a natural fiber brush or synthetic. Um, very thirsty soap. One of the more thirsty soaps I've used in recent memory. Probably as thirsty as something like the uh, Declaration Grooming Bison Tallow. Uh, but the result of proper hydration yields you a lather that has that nice gooey, gluey consistency with a nice sheen to it. Kind of like um, sour cream or creme fraiche, if you will. The uh, slickness, both primary and residual slickness, are excellent on this soap. The post shave is also excellent. Um, this is really a very nice overall soap base got a lot of good attributes to it and um, I can see why it's widely loved by those that have uh, been able to be fortunate enough to obtain it prior to West Coast Shaving recently carrying it. So the resulting shave score that this uh, soap base gets is a 90. 90 puts it in line with soap bases such as tallow and steel as well as with oleo soap works all right folks we're back uh wonderful shave with uh euphros premium tallow and the uh, dama de noche scent i uh, really like the post shave feel i haven't put on an after shave i'll probably wait a little while and kind of evaluate it a bit further, but skin's feeling smooth and soft right now, um, which is a, a great attribute in any soap base. Uh, definitely check this out. Like I said, for if you're in the US, it's available at uh, West Coast Shaving now. Um, 
do believe it's on the higher side of price, but as you can see from the uh, review, the uh, the performance is up there. So it's it might be worth your pennies if you uh, have the income to spare. As always, thumbs up the video if you enjoyed it. Comment below if you have anything to say. And if you're not already a subscriber, please become one. See ya.